Now, the Trump administration has announced that it will end temporary legal status of Salvadoran immigrants in July 2019. The decision could lead to the expulsion of more than 200,000 people of many who are part of a human humanitarian program that was granted after a series of earthquakes rocked El Salvador in 2001. This is the latest and most significant move by the Trump administration. It's their fight against temporary protected status and immigration program that allows immigrants to stay in the U.S. and work legally after their home countries are struck by natural disasters of war. El Salvador is the fourth country for which Trump has made such an announcement. The government has said that it needs to end the temporary status to provide a permanent solution. The decision comes as the Congress is negotiating continued protection for some 800,000 dreamers, the undocumented immigrants who were brought to U.S. as children. Their special status under the Obama era, Deferred Action for Childhood Arrivals, or the DACA, will end in March unless the Congress intervenes.